Hey marshmallows! This is the Word of Marshmallow podcast. Today, I'll be talking about the unusual history I have when it comes to consuming milk and dairy products. When I was a baby, I used to love drinking my milk formula. I drank the milk, then threw the bottle on the floor when I was finished with it. But the very first time I drank actual milk took place a little over a decade ago when I was but a young child. We were on an airplane and my mom ran out of milk for me. So, she gave me fresh milk from the plane instead. I threw up, possibly from the milk, and the traumatization that I got from that experience stayed with me until I started milk. The only way to get me to drink milk was to mix chocolate pea sugar powder into it. I think my mom bought chocolate pediasure for me because I wasn't growing as much as I should have, but I really don't know. Nevertheless, the pediasure actually tasted pretty good. On the other hand, in elementary school, I still enjoyed other dairy products, such as yogurt, cheese, and of course, ice cream. So, the fact that I wasn't a huge fan of plain milk didn't completely stop me from eating stuff with dairy in it. Now let's fast forward to a few years ago, when I drank some A little while after I drank it, I got heartburn. I'm honestly not sure if it was the that caused it, because I don't remember what else I ate that day. But I do remember that I was around Easter, so luckily I was on spring break. On Easter day, I unfortunately couldn't eat any of the food that I wanted to due to the pain and the fact that my stomach was too sensitive to eat too much. Anyways, at one point, my mom and I thought I was allergic to milk for some reason. But I never was. I guess I was just lactose intolerant for a time. In quarantine, my school started to give out free meals to those who didn't have access to a supply of food at home. Of course, my family decided to take advantage of the opportunity and pick up some meals every time they could, which was pretty much every weekday of the week. There were two meals per bag, and one milk carton per meal, so we had a lot of milk. Eventually, the milk came in bags instead of cartons, which made me a bit uncomfortable at first. However, I ended up having to drink the milk anyways. Obviously, it didn't taste much different from milk in a carton. Later on, some of the milk got spoiled and tasted really weird, which led to us being extremely paranoid about drinking the milk. We still get the meals, but we use the milk for other things now. The school has been giving out free meals for over a year now, but they are going to stop giving them out. They also give out cream cheese, which I still love eating this snack. Luckily, I'm not paranoid about eating it. And that's my history with consuming milk and dairy products. I would like to thank you all for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed listening to this week's episode of Where the Marshmallow. Have a wonderful rest of your day, and 